Well, obviously it's always good to win. Uh, it's good to win on the road. It's good to beat an FBS opponent. Uh, hey, they'll be the first one to tell you we could have played better, but I've been doing this long enough. There's no ugly wins. Um, but certainly had our moments. Glad to see the guys battle and certainly showed some signs of uh, life. But to win an opener and, like I said, beat an FBS team, and it says a lot about the work they put in over the summer and PRPs and what Coach Burke has done. With them. So we're happy about that. We really don't, we didn't make a big deal about it. We really didn't. Uh, we got to stand for a couple weeks. It, it is what it is. The schedule is what it is. So you got to line up and play. And I, I learned a long time ago at Jim Soaker, don't worry about the decal on the helmet, just play. And uh, that's really what we talked about. We didn't put a, overemphasize it. Uh, we know they have guys and a lot of good coaches on his staff. And so we just tried to get, uh, get prepared as best we could and come down here and play our best. And, we played well enough to win, but I, I think we still have some things we can work on. But uh, yeah, it's a good to start the season with a win. Boy, you did a nice job, huh? He's really a tough, tough kid, and uh, he can make people miss in space. And while he may not be the 100 meter champion, I mean, he's just a solid boxer. I mean, if this guy were the Olympics, you know, he, he, you'd, you'd want to put your money on him. He's uh, Real tough kid, real dependable playmaker. Uh, made a lot of people miss in the hole, and just tough. I mean, just I think good running backs get better as the game goes on, and he, he does that. What was that first half like, especially the first quarter? Just every drive, you know, not even getting three minutes up and down the field. Yeah, it was fun, and those people have seen us play before. That's kind of how we can be. Uh, I don't like to be streaky. I mean, we love to finish up at times, but uh, we try to go fast and lose the tempo. And I think time of possession is the most overrated stat in football. We don't worry about that too much. Our defensive coordinator does it up and like it. Uh, but yeah, it's fun. It's fun for the fans. It's fun for the guys. It's uh, basketball and grass. Well, I, obviously the safety for them, I think, was stole a lot of momentum. Now, unfortunately, we couldn't we couldn't convert. But I give our guys a lot of credit. They had the big play. They start getting a little momentum, and then we were able to answer. And I thought that showed a lot of character by by our guys when it kind of seemed like because when you have people backed up, you have to take advantage of it. And we were just we just couldn't we couldn't do it. We couldn't. We kept kicking the ball back down there, and then we kind of stall out. Then kind of score an extra touchdown after that safety and give them credit. They came back, but uh, we were able to kind of make one up and down the stretch. And, uh, but I think the safety. We always talk about the first drive after half, uh, and it has a lot. It says a lot about the, the second half. Okay, when you snap the ball over your quarterback's head, you get a safety. That's just hard. It's just demoralizing. It's hard. Any other questions?